she nearly took my arm off at the elbow. Couldn't get close to her. She would have been attacked so badly by other wombats. All I could do was spray her wounds with an antiseptic. I know, that's your cross face, isn't it? I just needed her to trust me enough so that I could manage her injuries and help her to recover. The first time she showed me that trust was when she invited me to scratch her belly. So need to be physically big enough to defend themselves in the wild. She knows when I'm going to weigh her and she doesn't like to be picked up. Can we do this? Are we going to do this? Hey, I got you. Oh, I got you. Right, stay still. It's like having a short, fat toddler. Good girl. Wait on. Gotcha. Oh. Wombats have got no handles. They're like a football shape. You must have put on weight this week. 16 kilos. Now you get on yourself. She's actually gaining enough weight now. 17.4 kilos, yay! I'm optimistic that she'll be released in a few weeks. The biggest sign that she had recovered for me was that she began to show signs of being happy. <laughs> you goose. And the head shake, which is sort of like, nah, 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 you can't catch me. Are you happy? <laughs> This is Marinda's last graze in our garden. We're very shortly going to load her into the car and take her out to her release site. This is it, we're here. You're not ready? Come on. Marinda, I'm not carrying you. Marinda is a Gadigal word for beautiful. So we were optimistic when we named her Marinda.